Next tonight, two former Proud Boys members sentenced for their actions on January 6th. Ethan Nordine ordered behind bars for 18 years, tying the longest sentence so far. And Dominic Pozzola, who infamously used an officer's shield to smash a Capitol window, sentenced to 10 years in prison. During the hearing, Pozzola spoke of regret and pleaded for leniency. And yet, when he was led away moments later, he shouted, Trump won. Here's ABC's Martha Raddatz. Tonight, former Proud Boys member Dominic Pozzola, who was captured on video smashing a window in the Capitol with a stolen police riot shield on January 6th, sentenced to 10 years in prison. Pozzola appearing defiant today, pumping his fist and shouting Trump won as he left the courtroom. But some 40 minutes prior, Pozzola, weeping at times, was begging the judge for mercy, saying, Your Honor, I stand before you as a changed and humbled man with a heart full of regret. The judge called Pozzola the tip of the spear in breaching the Capitol that day, and prosecutors say once rioters streamed inside the building, Pozzola recorded this video to brag. Victory smoke in the Capitol, boys! Prosecutors had asked for an even stiffer sentence, calling Pozzola a poster boy for the conspiracy. And that seemed apparent with that defiant shout of Trump won, even after claiming regret. Another former member of the Proud Boys, Ethan Nordine, as you said, got an 18-year sentence today, as stiff a penalty as Oath Keepers leader, Stuart Rhodes. The judge saying before he sentenced Nordine, if we don't have the peaceful transfer of power, I don't know what we have. Mary? Okay, Martha, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.